Many years ago, I was discussing the Christian faith with a preacher called Ian Leach, who had been visiting the church I attended in Glasgow. Ian said to me something I have never forgotten. He said, Evelyn, if you were only able to read one verse in the whole Bible, I would recommend that you read this verse. Look at it every day, write it out and put it in a prominent place so you can always see it, memorise it and act on it. The verse was Philippians 4 verse 8. And now, dear brothers and sisters, one final thing. Fix your thoughts on what is true and honourable and right and pure and lovely and admirable. Think about things that are excellent and worthy of praise. Amen. What do we think about? What are our thoughts concentrated on? With our world as it is, with the coronavirus which adds to more loneliness, more loss and sadness, with so much bad news on the television, we hear about so much evil and unhappiness in the world that we ourselves end up having thoughts of self-pity and negativity. Paul is telling Christians to concentrate not on the things of the world, but to focus our minds on the truth. Things that are honest and reliable, not false or lies. Things that are honourable and revered not superficial, things that are pure, things that are lovely, referring to things that are agreeable and pleasing, and things that are admirable and excellent and worthy of our praise. All of these things refer to Jesus. Jesus is the fullness of truth. And nobility. He is just and pure, lovely and admirable and worthy of all our praises. Yes, bad things will happen in the world, but Jesus has overcome the world. His death and resurrection has set us free and he is with us and by our side through our struggles. We just need to call out to him. As believers, our minds have been freed to think on these things in Philippians 4 verse 8, rather than on the many negative and selfish thoughts that could consume us every day. Let our lives reflect Jesus in all we do, in all we say, and in all we think. Amen. Let us pray. Our loving God, how we praise you and lift your name on high. Lord, you know our hearts and our minds. Forgive us when we don't focus on you and when we let the world and the things of the world get in our way. Lord, focus our minds on you, on your word. May we meditate on it daily. On your cross, you shed your blood for us. On your resurrection, now we are free 
and will have eternal life with you on your love. We don't know why you love us, but we are so grateful that you do. Let us live our lives for you. And may your Holy Spirit work in us so we may imitate the humility of Jesus and show his love to others. Strengthen us, Lord, when life feels tough. Comfort us through the sad times. We thank you that you love us and will never leave us. For that we are eternally grateful. You are our hope and joy and strength. We praise your name, O Lord. I pray all this in Jesus' precious name. Amen. Above all powers, above all kings, above all nature and all created things, above all wisdom and all the ways of man, you were here before the world began. Above all kingdoms, above all thrones, above all wonders the world has ever known, above all wealth and treasures of the earth.